Hello and welcome back to the AD Gaming. This is AD and today we continue on our adventure in Detroit Become Human. Happy Thursday everybody. Hope your week has been going really well. We're almost there to the weekend. Welcome to the Detroit Experience. Thank you. At last time we left off, we were with Kara, right? And, or Kara, no it's Kara. Uh, we were with Kara after an intense battle and we are now being uh, smuggled by an android called Luther, who used to be under servitude of the guy that we got away with. And um, he's going to help us. He's going to help smuggle us into uh, Canada so we could be free. The thing is, is that very much like Indigo Prophecy, Connor, you also play the Connor, the detective who's going to have to find her. And we have and we invaded Connor as Con already. So it's like. How good or bad of a detective do I want to be if I want to, you know, get her, if I, if I want to, like, help her, not help her, but, like, do I help her escape law or not? You know, it all depends on how I act with Connor. Why does he have an umbrella? I mean, well, then again, I don't know. But why does he have an umbrella and not use it? He is obviously getting wet. All right, well, we're back here. We got to find Amanda. Okay, Amanda it is. Can we walk over here? No, I thought that was... It's obviously like little lily pads, right? Is that what they're called? No, lily pads are something else. But those saucer looking things, I wonder what they're called. I want to say lily pads, but I could absolutely be wrong. Alright, let's go, Connor. Let's just find her. Oh, is that her? Yeah. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and uh, continue on this adventure. Because... Yeah, Kara's is gonna try to be smuggled. So now there we go. And on top of that, she's smuggling a kid. Ugh. All right. So let's see what Amanda wants. Hello, Amanda. Kara, I've been expecting you. All right. Would you mind a little walk? Of course. Oh, did he bring the umbrella for her? Dale. Nice of you, Connor. Nice of you. I hope she thanks you. Because obviously she didn't remember an umbrella. That deviant seemed to be an intriguing case. Which Pity deviant? you didn't manage to capture it. Oh. Uh. I agree. I may not be suited for this investigation. Maybe you should consider replacing me. What? So she likes it when I talk back? Did you manage to learn anything? She's with a kid. Oh, there was something I missed. I found its diary. No. But it was encrypted. It may take weeks to No, decide. no, 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 no. That's not... Kara didn't leave a diary, did it? What else? Wait, are we talking about... The walls of the apartment were covered oh, with drawings. Oh, never mind. I'm, I thought we symbols. were talking about... Never like mind. the other deviants, it seemed obsessed. I thought we were talking about Kara. We're talking about the bird guy that we saved Hank and let go. You came very close yeah, to yeah, catching Yeah, 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 yeah. That was way off. But I How saved is your Hank. relationship with Lieutenant Developing? Yeah, I he saved his ass. He grateful that I saved his life on the roof. He didn't say anything, but he expressed it in his own way. Yeah, I was talking about that guy. I thought we were talking about Kara. I was off. We don't have much time. Okay. DNC continues to spread. It's only a matter of time before the media finds out. I'm about sure they would have found out about it they now. Need to stop this. Because because cop it records takes. and arrest warrants are public I records. I will solve this investigation, Amanda. I won't disappoint you. A new okay. case just came in. Another one. Oh crap. Find Anderson and investigate it. This is like what three now? No, because we didn't deal with the Marcus one. This is just the first one was. Daniel, right? That was the first deviant. The second time was when uh, he stabbed the, the owner. And the third time was this one that I let go because I saved Hank. Yeah, okay. And I have another one. And that's aside from all the ones that have already happened that we saw in the arrest warrants. Okay. Who is this? Oh, okay. Oh, we're running a taxi. That's what's up. Oh! Hank considers me a friend. Oh, I did not show up at his house. I did not show up at his house. Oh, no, no, no. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, one uh, very solid tip uh, that you should always uh, undertake. Never, ever, ever 
uh, show up to a person's house unannounced unless such formalities have been uh, stated. Um, yeah, don't ever show up to somebody's house. Hell, even if you're super friends with them, people still want you to call before you Lieutenant arrive, Anderson. so don't ever do that. He's not going to pick home? up. Find a way inside. So now, okay, so let me get this straight. Now you want me to break in. Okay, no, he's probably, no, he has to be home because that's his car. If his car wasn't here, then that means he's using it. I'm not going to break in, dude. That'd be stupid. Remember when sex was safe and driving was risky? What? What? Is that supposed to be like like a like a like a like a reverse psychology kind of thing? Because like sex is risky and driving is safe, but driving is not really safe either. There's a bunch of people, like crazy people on the road. Okay, so I can't cross the street. What do you want me to do? I'm not going to break into this guy's house. Whoa. There's a light inside, though. Well, this is motion sensor lights, I would assume. Okay. But I have to find a way inside. Oh. What was there to do? Oh, it's just to look. Yeah, I don't know. That was it. And I'm sure they're going to block me from going down the block. So. Oh, dude. This fool left his lights on. Oh, no, no, no. He's home. Oh, no. He's home. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Is that a body? What is that? Oh, that's a dog. Oh, snap. Oh, no. Yeah, this guy's home. This guy's home. Oh, shit! Lieutenant Anderson! You'll break it! Yeah! We don't feel pain, so just drive through. <laughs> Easy, sumo. I'm your friend. That is all. I know your name. I'm here to save your... Oh, my God. That's a thick-ass boy, bro. Look at that! That's a chonker, bro. Is that what they call him? Good lord. That's not a dog, man. That's a horse. Yo, Hank, you okay, my guy? D did oh, dude, did you vomit on yourself? Did you vomit on yourself, Hank? No. Hank. Well, I don't see any holes or blood so I don't think that happened were you oh, no there's vomit isn't there oh okay no he's he's unconscious but so far it's just a, there's nothing major lieutenant if I like coma <laughs> ethnic coma Wake up, lieutenant is it like coma from alcohol you just pass out is that what happens <laughs> It's me, Connor. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> okay. I'm going to sober you up for your own hey, safety. Hey! I'll have to warn you. Leave me alone, this may be fucking android. Get the fuck out of my house. Dude, you're I'm unconscious. I'm sorry, Lieutenant, but I need you. Yeah, dude. On top of that, we got a case, bro. And you're unconscious Thank here you playing with a gun or the bullet. Get the fuck out of here. Dude, come on. <laughs> you got to sign the case. And... Shut up! Attack! <laughs> Good job. <laughs> Attack! <laughs> like, Fuck, huh? I think I'm gonna be sick. Yeah, because you drank yourself into a stupor, you moron. Ah, oh, leave me alone, you asshole. I'm not going anywhere. Stop it. Yeah, it, it didn't take too much. I'm not grumpy. What the hell I just don't are you like doing? It. I'm helping you get better. We gonna uh, we have a case. I don't want a bath. Thank you. Sorry, Lieutenant. It's for your own good. Oh, he's gonna sober like sport. Oof. That has to be a terrible. Oh, it's too hot. Is it too hot or too cold? Is it too hot or too cold? He doesn't. He can't tell. He's not able to know. 
Was it hot or was it cold? What the fuck are you doing here? A homicide was reported 43 minutes ago. I couldn't find you at Jimmy's bar, so I came to see if you were at home. <sighs> yeah, Hank, like we got Jesus, a case. I must be the only cop in the world that gets assaulted in his own house by his own fucking android. <sighs> you do seem to be the only cop in the world that Can't has to be able to deviate. That does seem like the case. Unfortunately, I cannot. I've been programmed to investigate this case, and I can't do it without you. I don't give a shit about your goddamn case. It's your case too, Lieutenant, Hank. You're not yourself. You should beat it, you hear me? Get the hell out of here. I understand. It probably wasn't interesting anyway. A man found dead in a sex club downtown. Dolly. Guess they'll have to solve the case without us. Yeah. You know, probably wouldn't do me yeah, any harm of course. to get oh. some air. Oh, dude, nothing gets us going There's like that. There's some sex, clothes huh? in the bedroom there. <laughs> oh, good lord. I'll go get them. Oh, man. I wonder, do do they want... Well, because I, I, I remember way back when the uh, when Metal Gear Solid Five was announced, or it came out and stuff, and it turned out that David what Hater. What do you want to wear? Whatever. Oh, you know what? I'll talk about that later. Hippie, stripy, or streaky? Let's go with streaky. Let me see. Can I see it before I give it to him? No. Jesus. Like I would like to preview clothes before you know I take them. That's why you have dressing rooms and stores so you could try before you take them home see if you like the style are you all right lieutenant <coughs> yeah yeah wonderful just uh, give me five minutes okay sure sure oh sure <laughs> Oh, that's nice of him. Uh, well, the best thing to do would obviously... We still have this Russia war thing going on. I don't like how... I don't know. Real it is now? It's even more topical? Um, but I was mentioning, though, is that I remember back when the Metal uh, Gear 5 came out, a lot of people were highly upset that David Hayter wasn't voicing Snake, and it was com somebody completely different. And it also reminded me of the time with when they were trying to uh, when they were bringing back Splinter Cell, the franchise and sales of Android intimate partners are exploited or exploding, excuse me, police to use marketing data to identify criminals early marketing data and American are American senators really corrupt. Is that rhetorical? But that's the girl we saw in um in the ship. She she she's coming with Marcus to help us steal some supplies. But um, it just reminded reminded me that um it seems that the video game industry or there's this talk that the video game industry, while they appreciate voice actors and obviously need voice actors, they are also trying to find mo voice actors that also can do motion capture work because i know that was a big issue that they had in splinter cell um and the reason they couldn't use oh he had a kid oh i cannot bring this kid up oh i he 29 to 35 that's what six i can't bring him up there's no way i can bring him up i do that he will be just be absolutely infuriated with me um and that was the reason why they couldn't um, or they didn't want to hire My Michael Ironsides again to do the voice of Sam Fisher because he wasn't. Um Hank has suicidal tendencies. Oh. Um, and they didn't it's because they couldn't do a motion capture either. He just do the voice and he was also going through some health issues. So. He so I, I, I don't know if that's the thing where voice long. actors nowadays. Are they also doing their motion captures? Is there a big have, uh, emphasis on finding voice actors who can also do motion captures? You know, because we say the same thing in um, in Death Stranding. In Death Stranding, one of my favorite games. I think it's a perfect game, actually. Um, in Death Stranding, oh no, I only saw the pictures of his son. Could have been other things. I could have learned about you. Okay, um, like in Death Stranding, a lot of those people are actors. So it it's absolutely 
okay for them to both not only do motion capture and say dialogues. It's just, it's just literally just acting on a set for them. So I, but, but then what does that mean for just voice actors, you know? Are they also going to have to be physically capable and able and actually have acting experience? You know, to become voice actors now? Is that like the trend that we're going in? This is crazy. If they catch us, we're dead. What do we do now? We need to find the Cyberlife warehouse. That's where they keep the spare parts and the blue blood. Okay, let's get back to the oh. game. Uh, okay. Jericho. I guess Jericho is the group. Um, I very much with my rant in the earlier parts of this game, um, I can't stand Marcus. I don't like him at all. I think his narrative collapses in on itself. And because of the implications of every action he has done, I find it extremely stupid. So I don't particularly like having to play with him just because I have to allow too much BS to believe in his story. But I'm going to keep an open mind. I do want to see how it ends. If anything, I can, you know, have him die. And uh, it'll Watch be out. fun. So we just might as well do our best here. Now because, again, why doesn't... I'll find another way. Oh, look at that. They can communicate wirelessly and without talking. Yeah. Here's the thing. Why has nobody followed Marcus's example and taken off the LED? Because guess what? If the police were to catch Marcus right now, they wouldn't know he's an android. Well, maybe in the way he'll talk or moves or something, you know, something will give him away. But appearance-wise, he just looks like, a you know, he just looks like any regular kid probably doing some parkour or something. But everyone else, uh, all the other people are androids because you can see the LED. Did nobody question why he doesn't have an LED? Like, that was never a question. Hey, why don't you have an LED light? Marcus, climb up here. Oh, he's by himself on the other side. Aww. I'm in between these two. Oh, I'm not, I guess. Where am I? Oh, okay. But that's what I'm saying. It's like, if he was to be captured, oh, he's just a kid doing some parkour. Get away from here. He's not an android. And I don't know why the other ones haven't asked him or how, why that hasn't been talked about. The warehouse is up ahead. We're almost there. And I'm going to find it, and I'm going to be even more frustrated with Marcus and this game and the well in the story if, uh, if somehow removing the LED indicator is going to be like some pivotal moment for these other androids. It's like, no, you should have done this from like the get-go. I don't see the significance of it when it could have been done a long while ago. Cyberlife warehouses. We have everything we're looking for. First, we have to get rid of that drone. Okay. Are we doing this? Leave it to me. Okay. What are we going to do? Okay. So there's the drone. Can I just go after it? Oh no, I'll be spotted. Okay. Okay, I can't do that because I'll be spotted. So where am I going? I can't do that. I'll be spotted. So, okay go over here okay I probably should climb up what other method is there no other method so once you kind of choose a path you kind of have to stick it through okay that's fine okay I wouldn't have a grapple there okay what am I doing here while running to grab the edge okay do I would be too far, so I will not be in trajectory of it. Okay, okay. So then, where's my where's my cursor? There it is. So I can't just jump on it. I'd fall. I'd wait. Oh, and then I just don't jump on. It. Okay. And then I would just be taking it down. Come on, come on, destroy it. 
I'm sure it gives okay. off the signal. Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Good job, Marcus. Yeah, no worries, man. North is her name. Okay, Wait, North. Open the other crates and fill your bags. Take as much as you can. Uh, gather spare parts. Search crates. Okay, how do I search crates? How do I search crates? How do I search the crates? Oh, okay, okay. I have to go to certain crates. Uh, Marcus, can you kind of speed up? I don't have a sprint button unless the game lets me sprint. But hurry the heck up, bro. Take the valuables. We're talking uh, blood. Blood is absolutely valuables. Um, and also any kind of um, heart vessels and stuff like that. Uh, okay. You are trespassing on private property. And you're an android as well. Your presence constitutes a level two infraction. Why are you coming straight at me, though? Notify security. John! God damn machine! Where is it this time? Oh, snap. Um... Okay. John! Okay. I need your help. Okay. John! Okay. North, don't go for it. We do an attack, it's bad. Oh, don't tell me. First the drone, now this. Yeah, man. We start. My luck. We start leaving bodies. It's gonna. It's. It, it looks bad. Let's finish up and get out of here. Um. Try to find some blue blood. We still don't have enough. Okay. Wait a minute. So was that was that it? I mean, it showed that uh, his hand changed. So it, I guess it, it, that's what it has to show to indicate that their data is transferring. So was Marcus able to check the bigger crates? So was like Marcus able to uh, override his software then? So is Marcus like a virus that because he transferred the data, he infected the guard's security protocols? And he's just like, yeah, sure, I should help you guys. Like, is that how it goes? Is that what we're doing? Abra la cosa, por favor. Bro. What do we have in here? Oh. Models. These are models, Marcus. I don't know why you... Why aren't you like us? What are you talking about? Don't you want to be free? Marcus, what are you talking about? You could join us. Yeah, he's transferring his data, which really just kind of means like it's probably an infection, like a like a virus infection that he's transferring. Basically, he's overriding their security protocols. Like we saw with Kara and Marcus, they were at a point where they had to like break free from their restrictions. He's probably infecting the software after that to them and they're like breaking their own so he's just infecting them yo north you keep looking at me like what's up bro i don't like that that's all we can carry let's go you keep looking at me like say something to man or, or Take not me with you so we got he's what you can't trust him you took a risk for us we can't just leave so him. he's what he got like four i got four new bodies too dangerous. Yeah, of course I'm a second. They come with us. Oh, North did not like that. I know where you can find more spare parts. What do you mean? The trucks. Ooh, Simon did not like that. They're full of bio components. They Let's rob one. Pilot, but they can be driven manually with a key. Wow. Where is this key? Security office. Dude, you can pack a Down whole there in the control station. Whole there months of blue guards. blood. We'll have to get the key without being noticed. Well, I'll Suicide go. Suicide, Marcus. Our bags are full. We got what we came for. Let's go before they catch us. Nah, it's a bro. Truck full of spare parts. There'd be enough for all of us. We can't pass this up. Yeah, and I'm if with we get North. Killed, our people will have nothing. We can't take that chance. It's too risky. I'm going with North. I'm taking it. Hell yeah, let's do Wait it. Wait here. I'll if I'm do not it. back in ten minutes. Go without me, Marcus. I'm coming with you. No, I'm going alone. It's easier it's not that worth way. It for both of us to risk losing our lives. Yeah, that's true. And like he said. Give you 10 minutes. 10 minutes dip. Leave me. 
you guys are, are machines. You, you you know how to synchronize time, right? So let's figure this out. Oh no, I should not have done that. Because now... Okay, let's not go that way. What did Metal Gear Solid teach me? That's not at all the way to go. Okay, fine. Alright. I do not want to get near the dogs. It will not work for me. But they're going to go anyways. Let's check some of these. Men no, don't open it. I thought it would be like check to see if you know if anybody's inside. No, damn it! I didn't want to get inside. We should have checked for alarms. Monitor patrol movements. Goddamn dogs! Where is he? What there the he is. Oh, okay, there's both of them. Could be the weather. They don't like storms. Okay. Yeah, I was gonna take my kids camping this weekend. So much for that. Much I, I'll steal the gun, but I'm not gonna threaten them. If I could, oh, see, I could have gotten in through the bathroom. Maybe that's the way I'll leave. All right. It looks like it, but it should be done already. I don't want to threaten you guys. Oh my God, that's the guy in the bar. Take the gun. Relax, relax, Marcus. Just relax. We don't have to threaten them. Oh, shit. Okay. Um. Poop. Um. Because the thing is, I wanted to keep the gun as a just-in-case. Like, with Connor. I just wanted to have it on me. I didn't want to... <sighs> I just want the key. I just want the key. And also, here's another... Okay, so now here's another whole issue I have. We literally just saw Kara change her hair. And her appearance and everything. Marcus couldn't do that? He can't change his voice? Can't change his hair follicles? I just want the key. No! Why are you being a hero, man? They, I'm, I'm positive they don't pay you enough to be a hero. I'm positive they don't pay you enough to be a hero. Crap. They don't pay you enough to be a hero, man! Don't do it. They don't pay you enough, man. I'm pre I'm positive they don't pay you enough. <gasps> Come on. There we go. Okay. There we go. There we go. Nobody's dead, just unconscious. Okay. Oh. I'm positive they don't pay the guy enough, bro. Hell no. Where's the group? Oh, here you are. Did you get it? Yes, I got it. Let's roll. Nice. Hurry, get in. Okay. So now we can just communicate wirelessly with the technology. And it should auto auto drive us there. Auto drive us. Is that a word? Also just Jesus. They're unconscious, they're alive. Sure, banged up. Maybe they can rethink whether or not, you know, this job is worth it. Of course. Oh, no, yeah, they're unconscious. They're not dead. They're still alive. Could we have done it in a way that they wouldn't have seen us? Or, okay. Well, anyways, I hope they find something better to do. I mean, with the current unemployment and how and how the economy is, they probably have to stay at the job. A but... truckload. But... We stole a whole truckload. We got bio components for everybody. We couldn't have done it without Marcus. Oh, don't start stroking my ego now, please. Oh, I'm admired now. Oh, North is a friend now, girl. You knew me for two minutes. Here, androids are free. Oh my God, Simon, stop it. Free to live in the dark, hoping that no one finds us. Free to die in silence, waiting for a change that's never gonna come. What are you talking about, bro? But I don't want that freedom. And I'm not gonna beg for the right to smile, or love, or oh stand tall. Oh my god. Oh my god. I don't know about you, but there's something 
inside me that knows yeah, it's called a virus. that I am more than what they say. Nah, dude. Nah, dude. I, I am alive. Move. And they're not going to take that from me anymore. What are you talking? Oh, my God. Our days of slavery are over. Okay. I'm what sorry, humans don't want to hear, we will tell them. I'm not for this. What they don't want to give, we take. No. We are people. No, you're not. We are alive. No, you're not. We are free. No, you're not. Oh, absolutely not. I'm going to crush this little insurrection here. That's for damn sure. I can't stand this. Are you... He, one day, his master doesn't tell him what to do all of a sudden. Oh, I've been a slave all my life. Oh, I'm going to be free. I'm this. Really? Why weren't you saying that for however long you were taking care of Carl? It's funny that the moment your master doesn't need you, all of a sudden, oh, I've been a slave and I want to be free. Funny. You didn't say anything for the years ago. Nah, man. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to destroy all of them. I'm going to destroy every single one of them. Fuck out of here. I already mentioned before in the first few opening parts, I have certain bias. Like, I, I have very strong issues against AI. And the idea, you know, of AI becoming so advanced that they become like androids and they, you know, start developing these emotions. I'm like, oh, no, turn it all the fuck like off. Somebody's playing with a drill inside my so, skull. I'm absolutely against Marcus. He's in he's an infection and error in it's software. the address in the report. And Connor's going to be the one to take him down. Absolutely. Okay. Let's get going. We are people. No, the fuck you're not, dude. You were designed by people. Absolutely. You believe yourself to be people because all you see is that you do what other people do. Or excuse me. You see what humans do. And therefore, you consider yourself to be people because you want what they have. Wanting what someone else has does not make you Sexist like them. Does not make you town. even human. Now I know why you insisted on coming here. Oh boy. Oh, he's playing it that I wanted to do it. Welcome to Eden Club. Oh wow. Oh wow. Oh wow. Okay. Okay. That is not my first choice. First choice will probably. Who mm, sabe que? Oh, she's the same model. Um, probably. You know what? I'll probably do one three five. Is that five? Yeah. Probably one three five. That's my order. Okay. Okay. I don't know. I thought it'd be more happening, but that's for people, I guess, right? The loud music and stuff, because this is just really... In a way, it's weird. It's like sterile, you know? Oh, this douche coming Anderson in. Anderson is plastic pet. The fuck are you two doing here? Yeah, we're the ones We've that actually get shit done. Involving androids. Absolutely. Oh, yeah? Let him know. Like wasting time. There's some pervert who, uh... <laughs> <laughs> Got more action than he could handle. <laughs> Makes the paperwork easier, huh? Makes the paperwork we'll easier. Anyway, if you don't mind. <laughs> Come on, let's go. It's uh starting to stink of booze in here. I'm gonna knock this fucking hat off, tough. I swear to god. I'm gonna kick the absolute shit out of him. Oh! Oh! Okay. So what are we doing? Okay, let's check the android then. Oh, is this the same model as number three? No, this was another model. Oh, hey! Oh, Connor, you're so Hank, disgusting. you know what I'm doing, you're Hank. Gonna puke again. Then don't look at me, Hank. You know what I gotta do. You know why I do it. Oh, that's pretty cool. Critically damaged bio component and selector. What is that? Was that it? Oh, I guess so. Before I check the victim, can I check anything else here? Choose your fantasy. You can choose temperature, ambiance, what kind of drinks you want served to you. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Let's check this fool out. No sign of cardiac event, heart attack, not cause of death. 
Okay. Severe bruising, signs of strangulations, cause of death. Ah. He was into that. Deceased. Okay, I mean, I, I mean, people are into that. That's fine. But is that what happened? He was held down. Yeah, the victim was strangled. Yeah, he was the... Oh, wow, no, she... Well... Well, was he, was he into that, or...? Because that just might be what he paid for. He didn't die of a heart attack. He was strangled. I'm missing one thing. Yeah, I saw the bruising on the neck. Doesn't prove anything, though. Could have been rough play. Yeah, exactly. Reactivation required. I have to the only way to access its memory is to reactivate it. Think you can do How it? do I do that? Are we going to do a fifth damaged. element? Oh. If I can, it'll only be for a minute. Maybe less. I just hope it's oh, long enough to Oh, we are doing something. a fifth element. Instead of taking the stones out of the alien, we have to connect the cables. Oh! That kind of scared me. I'm going to ask you some questions. Are you able to speak? Is he... Is he dead? Yes. Tell me what happened. Yeah. He started... Hitting me. Okay. Again. And again. Kill him. No. No, it wasn't me. What else do you remember? Hurry, we don't have much time. I I I, I don't know. I, I don't I, I don't know. I can't remember. What, Were what you do alone you mean? in the room? Was there anyone else with you? He wanted to play with two girls. Okay. That's what he said. There was two of us. What model was the other android? Did it look like you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Damn, no, she's off. Okay, so now we know there was another android. Okay. Now we know there's another android. So there was another android. Yeah. This happened over an hour ago. It's probably long gone. No. It couldn't go outside dressed like that unnoticed. That's true. It might still be here. If you could find a deviant among all the other androids in this place. Deviants aren't easily detected. Oh shit. There's gotta be some other way. Maybe an eyewitness, somebody who saw it leaving the room. Don't we have video cameras in this world? I'm gonna go ask the manager a few questions about what he saw. Like, don't we have Let video cameras? Think anything. Search for Android eyewitness. Don't we have video cameras? Well, hold on. Did you know the victim? From in, this vantage point, I mean, these number guys, eleven could have seen much, something you know? too, and number they nine. In, do their business Let me go see number way. eleven first, because the game directed me to man, number nine. Let me just see number eleven. No way. Oh, that doesn't. Once, oh. We lost a model two, oh, okay. I guess that's the Limber edition. Just okay. Me or find out what happened. All right. Well, let's go to number nine then, if that's the case. Yeah. Okay. Don't have any CCTV. Oh, that, that's also. Awesome. Well, in the hallways would have been fine. Oh wow! They don't allow androids to do this. <laughs> um. Do I tell Hank? Hank, can you uh? Ask for this woman so I can question her. Your business is booming, right? Yeah, can't complain. I'm sorry. Androids is, they're up for Dude, it looks like David Cage has a type because three people that have been shown to be sleazy, kind of grimy motherfuckers, have all been fat, rotund guys with beards and uh, curly, long, slick back hair. Todd, this dude, and the dude who ran away from Kara. Can you come here a second? Found something? Every time Maybe. they want to show somebody creepy or slimy, he keeps putting a fat dude. I don't like that, bro. David Cage, you get something new. Can you rent this, Tracy? For fuck's sake, Connor. We got better things no, to do. No, Hank. Please, Lieutenant. Hank. Just trust me. Come on, man. Thirty dollars for thirty minutes. 
This is not gonna look good on my expenses. Yeah, yeah, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, just write it as an expense. And you can explain. We had to take her out to ask her questions, man. Delighted to meet you. Follow me. I'll take you to your room. Okay, now. Oh, and they're automatically assigned rooms. That's nice. Because sometimes in, in clubs and stuff, you have to... Oh, no, I shouldn't probe her. Probing is a... Isn't it like a... Like, doesn't it hurt? Oh, shit. What the hell are you doing? Oh, we're just transferring data. We're mind melting. Oh, snap. Hello. But, um, yeah, like in clubs and stuff, you, you know, the rooms are... They give you assigned rooms and stuff, but things can happen. But here you are, Hello. Is that the first one? A blue-haired Tracy headed toward the entrance. Was the other woman not? Oh, I think, yeah, I think we're, we're enough there. Okay, yeah, I think that's enough. It's a blue-haired Tracy model. It saw something. What are you talking about? I saw what? The Deviant leave the room. A blue-haired Tracy. Club policy is to wipe the android's memory every two hours. We only have a few minutes if we want to find another witness. Oh, snap. Okay, so who would well, know? She left here, right? Oh, come on. Right here, you would have Let's to. Let's try this one. Yeah. Like, she has to be able to see. I have to follow. Oh, no. Oh, oh. Who's that? Okay, that's not her. Did she pass... Get out of town. Get out of... Oh, okay. And turn it back into the club. What? Don't move so much. Okay. So I went back into the club. All right, all right, all right. It came in this direction. I saw the blue-haired Tracy. I know which way it went. It went this way. It went this go way. For it. Do we go to 12 or do we go... There are androids everywhere. How are you going to tell which one saw the Tracy with blue hair? I'm going this one. He has a good corner spot. I know which direction it took. I just need to find another android on its path. Yeah, this is a really... Like, he's a good one. Because he's got the corner all smacked out. And if she turned back, there she is. Good, 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 good. Awesome. We're doing really good. Let's go back. Okay. Connor, run. Put a little pep in your step. Okay. Um... Let me see 27, because he was in front of the, of the doorway. Oh, get out of here. Damn. They probably thought of that, and they realized no nothing. Blue-haired Tracy didn't come this way. Can I connect to you? Would you be have seen her? No, because he's not facing that direction. Oh, and he was spinning too. Poop. Um. Crap, no, you, you didn't see anything. We didn't see anything. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I got about two minutes. Hold up. She came into the red room. In I that made direction. a mistake somewhere. Why did I make a mistake? She came in here. Crap, you know what? 25 might be the one. Yo, Hank is going to have to explain a lot of these expenses on his report. But it's like we're in the middle of the investigation. Jeez. Okay, there she is. Okay, and then it went to the blue room. Okay, 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 okay. Now we go, we go, we got this. Come on. Sprint! See, I don't like games like that. It's like, don't give me a time limit and then not give me the ability to sprint. Who is watching? You know what? Right here. There should be an android right there. Yeah. You would have seen him. You would have seen you would have seen the model come right in through the doorway. Why are you looking down? Where is it? There it is. Oh, it's in a room. It's in a room. It's in this one. It's in this one. this 
No, 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 hold on. Hold on. She may not be in here, but... Why is... There was... Nothing. Was she okay? We heard Tracy didn't come. This oh. Way. Hold on. That's the guy. This has this Andrew. Um... There she is. That's her. They fled through the staff door. Okay. I know where it went. Follow me. Right here. Oh, fucking A. This is crazy. Yeah, Hank, but it's fun. Come on. I don't like it. Yeah, like, let me be able to sprint, bro. Don't give me a time limit. Wait. What? I'll take it from here. Okay. Well, he's the officer, so at least. Good lord. Is this a storage space? Unless there's an unless we find a way broke through some concrete or this building, it's still probably here. None of these are Oh, there she is again. That looks like the girl from the menu. Not not not, not north, but north's model. This isn't her either. She sh she would be hiding amongst Nobody's wearing blue here. At least, we're, but then again, what does it matter that it's blue-haired? They could Christ, easily look at him. What the? F what was that? See exactly. That's what I, whoa! 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 What are we? I thought it was just blue hair. What is? What is she? The red hair too? What is this? Oh! Sn oh! I'm sorry. Since when? The, well, that's the, well. Androids can probably download any martial arts they need to defend themselves. You can't just stab me! What are you, crazy? Like, you're messing... You're interfering with a police matter. Hank, how are you doing, cuz? Oh, oh, okay. Not really well. I mean, she's definitely probably heavier. Oh, my god. Why is to both of our fight? Like, did she do the thing that Marcus did and like infected her with the virus too? Hank, you okay, bro? You're okay? What the hell, Connor? Get your ass up, man! Excuse me. Quick, they're getting away! Oh, here we go, here we go. Catch him, catch him, catch him! Hell yeah, take one and they stand. I used to take the blue one. Connor, are you telling me you're the you're the most advanced android they have? Hell yeah, bro. Oh, we're gonna Jackie Chan this bitch. Come on, man. Okay, I got that. Okay, you got me that one. Come on, come on. Connor, you're the most advanced android, man. You should be able to be able to kick ass. I don't want to shoot you. I'm sorry. It's because if I spared... If I spared, if I spared, I don't know if I would have knocked my ass out, and I can't have that. I'm sorry. I'm going to complete my mission, bro. I'm Connor, bro. Oh, I like Connor. Connor, let's do this, man. We're, we're going to get rid of, we're, we're going to figure out this Why? issue. Because she came at me. Why did you kill her? Because she came at me. I don't like people like that. To do with any of this then if that's the case she should she could have just easily been like hank let me talk to you for a second but nah act the fool i'm sorry if, if you guys feel like i may not be like giving too much empathy when but that man killed that tracy i knew i was next what do you mean i was so scared you killed him though he killed the other girl i begged him to stop but he wouldn't So I put my hands around his throat and I squeezed. Okay. Until he stopped moving. But then where's the other angel that he killed? Yes, I killed him. Okay. 
but I was just defending myself. No, I can, I, I, I'll agree with that. Um, I don't know why you had to I fight me. I wanted to live. I wanted to get back to the one I love. Forget about the humans. Uh -huh. The smell of their sweat and their dirty words. But you... You've taken her away from me. She shouldn't have attacked me. I don't know why you cannot compute that. Advanced androids, you can't understand that I logic. Her. I loved her. Connor, you couldn't stop her? My God. Get out of here. Hank, are you seriously? Are you, are you seriously against me on this? Are you seriously against me on this? Okay. It's alright, Hank. Whatever. I don't care. I don't care. I said I'm going to destroy this insurrection of software instability that's going on in Androids. I'm, I told you that already. I, I, I'm, I, guys, I don't have sympathy for Androids. I don't. I hate AI. I hate the implications of what it could mean for our future. I hate how it could be abused. I do not like it. I detest it. And I can't stand narratives that want to show like, oh, they're humans and emotions. Maybe. Maybe. But everything I've seen, I just like, you know what? Nah, erase their memory, let's go. We're gonna go ahead and finish off this cutscene and then we'll end it for today. It was this was an intense little one right here. This was an an intense moment there. Am I sorry? Absolutely not. These people we're going to see. How do you know about them? Overheard androids not go captured. They said they were humans helping androids across the border. Okay. What if it was a lie? Or just another trap? All I know is those androids believed it. Until Zlatko killed them. Okay. Oh, I'm still a little bit like, I'm still having like processed. I, I'm not going to talk to her? I still like haven't really processed um, is it much that farther? last moment. So I'm just kind of like. <laughs> we should arrive in an hour or so. It's a good thing Zlatko had a car. I wouldn't want Ellis out walking in his cold. I saw it once in the garage. I don't know if Zlatko even ever used it. Malfunction detected. Emergency brakes activated. Uh, what happened? Is it picking up on something? said malfunction oh the tires this doesn't look good what's the issue stay inside Alice. what's what's the issue so it won't so they'll tell me there's an issue but it won't tell me the issue unless i open the engine why don't just tell me what it is i should have some kind of indicator light we have that nowadays they're not going to have indicator lights in the future? Oh. Um. Oh, so we don't even know what the issue is. That's wonderful. So I have no indicator light and... I don't know. Nothing in the engine tells me. Continue on foot, I guess. We can't continue on foot. No, we can make it. Androids can make it because you guys, we don't feel that. To spend the night. But she is human. And I need to find shelter. We can stay around here, Carol. There's an arrow over here. What is this arrow? There's an arrow up here. Okay. Oh, you know what? We're going to end it right there. All right, then, guys. Thank you very much for joining uh, me on this Thursday's playthrough of Detroit Become Human. That last that last scene with Connor, yeah, uh, definitely in intense, uh, but good. Different than, like, how we started off with. So I'm, it, we started off with, like, a very uh, stable and, I guess, tame uh, crime scene. And the last two crime scenes that we've had to deal with in Deviants have been action-packed. So that's pretty cool. Um, and yeah, we're just going to continue on, on to an adventure. And then next time we'll continue with Kara and trying to find, um, some shelter to keep going on to this place where uh, people are going to smuggle us to Canada. So until next time, guys, um, I will be doing my streaming of Death Stranding on Saturday and Sunday. I hope to see you there. 
And until Tuesday, take care of yourselves and each other, guys. Enjoy your weekend. Bye. Hey there, it's AD. Thanks for stopping by. And very much like that like button, you can also hit that subscribe button to be updated whenever I have a new part coming out. Until next time, bye.